And we're here on your Friday Golden Warriors today, uh, getting ready for Sterling football tomorrow against Boylan in the state quarterfinals at Sterling Chevrolet Field. Uh, we're here with Coach Lummer and uh, Coach, just talk about uh, the week of prep. Uh, what uh, you know? What were the emphasis this week in preparing for a big quarterfinal game against a really good team? Um, you know, we talked about you know obviously there's three phases of the game that we got to be really good in, but. Um, you know, what we think it boils down to is, is stopping the run. You know, we have to stop the run, and, and uh, they're so good at what they do, you know, running the football. And um, I think they have the ability to throw it if they, if, they, um, if they feel they need to. They have kids capable of throwing it, catching and protecting. Um, pretty good kids, actually. And, and, but uh, they're, they're, they're built on running the football kind of like we are. And um, if, if we feel that, you know, we want to be in this game late in the fourth quarter, we've got to be able to stop the run. And uh, is it a, a, what about their running game makes them dangerous? Is it the talent of Trey Malone and Bergstrom, uh, the running of the two quarterbacks that they have, or is it their guys up front? You know, I think it's a little combo of all of them. I mean, I, I think if you look at them and you, and, and you see them on film and you look at their size and weight up front, they're not, you know, they're not going to overwhelm you with their size, but tech, you know, technique wise and um, when they get on you, they're tough to get. I mean, their kids are coached well and, and, you know, up front they do a good job. And then, you know, anytime it's in 24's hands, he, he's a special special player number one can be a really good player for him as well um and then you throw 11 three six you know a couple different guys you know running jet stuff uh getting side getting you know um east west and try to stretch you out um sideline to sideline and then like you said 18 17 the quarterbacks i mean they're able to uh you know pull it and get out the back side if they need to or, or, or get those tough yards so um they're they're really good offensively you know and so our, our kids understand it and it's easy to see so um it's about being where we're supposed to be at the right time and then when we get there executing and making the play and uh, and tackling it's a simple thing right i mean if you get an opportunity to make a tackle in space make a tackle in space because if you don't um they have the athletes to turn them into really big plays yeah, they do. And, uh, you know, gang tackling and getting get, getting a lot of guys to the football. And, and um, you know, I think we got some awfully good players. But to, to bring 24 down on your own, you know, it's going to be tough. So we, we need to get extra guys there. You know, uh, we need to make sure that we're, we're tackling low and, and um, you know, make sure we're, we're wrapping up and doing the things because we'll bounce off a guy like that. I mean, he's a, he's a good player, and I'm sure they're going to be really excited just like our kids are. And so the adrenaline will be going. But um, it's about doing the right things at the right times and, and making sure our kids, you know, I got the most confidence in them that they're going to execute and, and go out there and play a great game. Good teams run the ball and stop the run. That's Boylan. Uh, they're giving up less than two yards per rush defensively. Uh, what do you do uh, to try to you know crack that defensive nut? Because it's probably the best defense you've seen all year. Yeah, they're they're really good. You know, we've seen a couple good ones. You know, you know, talk about week four and, and and week nine, obviously against Sycamore. And these guys are they're there. You know, they're really good defensively, and they they run. Um, they have athletes with their hands on the ground. Their their linebackers are good, and then the back half, you know, they can come up and get in your face and play good man to man defense and, and and kind of challenge you so um you know I think they're kind of built on their defense you know just by looking at a lot of the things that they've done um they, they don't they don't bend or break much I mean they, they do a really good job of of doing what they're supposed to do and if you look at their score column not a lot of people score points so um you know our offensive our offensive line knows that it's going to be one up front and you know if we can get you know four or five yards here we got to take it you know and and, and uh, we got to get on those guys and stay on them because they're they're really good athletes Coach, uh, appreciate the time this morning, and uh, good luck against Boylan tomorrow. Thank you so much. That's Sterling Coach John Schlemmer here on your Friday Golden Warriors Today.